or good morning from Alton Towers. This is the first time that we've been here for six weeks, which is really terrible going by my standards, considering how often I came here last year and in the early part of this year as well. So it's been a, it's been a little while, but it's really good to be back here. I always love my trips to Alton Towers. It is a Saturday in the middle of the summer holidays, but the weather forecast for today is absolutely dreadful. It's been saying it's going to be, well, there's been weather warnings out all week saying Saturday's bad, stay inside everybody. But having looked at my phone just now, it is going to be windy for the, most of the day, which may affect the rides a little bit. But it's only going to rain, apparently, showery for about three hours in the afternoon. So that's not too bad. I can deal with that. Hopefully it'll keep the crowd levels down as well if the forecast's been bad all week. So we might be able to get on quite a few rides today. I can hear Wicker Man being tested through the trees over there, which is a good sign. Wicker Man's up and running. That's at least, well, it's not, we don't know if it's up and running yet. They're testing it. If they're testing it, then that's a positive sign that they are going to try and run it at park opening, despite it being quite windy this morning. So yeah, I think we're, I think we're onto a good one. I don't think there's anyone else here yet. I've not seen any other human beings on my little walk. I am really early though. It's like 25 to 9. And to be fair, they usually open the gates to let pass holders in for ERT at 9 o'clock with the rides opening at 9.30, the rides that are on ERT. But I've not seen anyone else here yet. Maybe there'll be some more people in the entrance plaza. Oh, by the way, in case you're wondering where Stevie is today, she's, uh, she's not well at the moment. So she's resting up at home, getting well soon. And we will see Stevie back in a future video, probably next week. A lovely entrance plaza. The iconic double corkscrew from the corkscrew roller coaster. But look, I'm not the first crazy person to be here. There are some even more crazy people who are even earlier than I am. In we go. And look what it's nearly time for. Scurfest starts on the 5th of October, which is only it's less than two months away. So actually, in the length of time since we've last been here, another kind of length of time like that again. And it'll be Scarefest time. It's exciting. Here with Rich today, by the way. We'll just interrupt his vlog. <laughs> He's busy talking about Scarefest. Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> despite the wind, we did actually hear Smiler testing from around the corner a minute ago, which is interesting. Smile is usually the first casualty of the wind, so we'll uh, we'll keep an eye on that. Oblivion's open for ERT though, or it should be at least in seven minutes. So we'll have a look, see what Smile is doing, and then go on either that or Oblivion or both. All quiet in the X sector. Oh, there you go. We are sending trains into the station at least on the Smiler up there. No sign of Oblivion testing yet. In fact, no sign of anybody else in X Sector. It's like we're not supposed to be in here. <laughs> they are sending the Smiler. It's just started to rain as well. walk-ons onto Oblivion, which is nice. Oblivion's running well this morning. This is the thing that I keep saying recently, everything's running well. And uh, just as we came off the second go, the queue line for the Smiler has been opened. So hopefully we're getting the Smiler straight away. Well, two goes on Oblivion and two goes on the Smiler. First time round uh, Smiler we went on the normal queue. The second time we jumped in a single rider queue, which is, it's built up a little bit of a queue now, 20 minutes or so. Not too bad though, it's a fairly, by summer standards, it's a fairly quiet day here. And the ride ops are kicking the trains out nice and quick, good operations on the Smiler today. So it was a little bit, a little bit shaky today. We'll, uh, we'll, let, we'll blame the weather I think. It's, uh, it definitely varies by... Loud, loud, loud Smiler. It definitely varies by the, uh, the train, because the second train I found less rattly than the first one. Maybe we'll give it another go later back in single rider when it stops raining. Now I'm going to head over to Rita, which has got no queue at the moment, got into the app. And why not get launched at 60 miles an hour into the rain? Dark forest's looking pretty dark today. The clouds hanging above in this drizzly rain. Rita is a complete walk-on, which is good to see. We'll jump on there. 
In fact, there's hardly any front row queue, so maybe we'll do the front row. Fancy front row, Rich? Yeah, man. Let's do it. Keep your head back. Hold on tight. You must escape. Go, go, go. You know what it's time for? Fright time. What's Nemesis up to today? I did hear it running a minute ago. I think it's fairly quiet here on Nemesis this morning. Da, 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 da. Zero minutes. That's what we like. I've got to tell you about Rita, by the way. We're on the front row, which is good. More or less a walk on it to wait for a couple of trains just because the front row queue had a few people in it. But it was enjoyable, nice and smooth today. But <laughs> with the rain, it was like lots of little prickles on the face. It was an interesting experience. It has stopped raining again now. So I'm just looking down at the stairs, trying to not fall downstairs and log in. Nearly there. Right, we're done. Yeah, so it's not raining in time for Nemesis, so hopefully the rain will be a bit kinder to our faces on Nemesis. Since you last saw us, we had uh, two goes on Nemesis, one on the front row, the front row ride was excellent. Really enjoyed that. And even had a go on Galactica, and Galactica was quite enjoyable today. It uh, felt a little bit more intense. Maybe it's the wet rails and the rain. It's really chucked it down for a bit, but for the most part, we were sat in pizza pasta buffet, eating some pizza and pasta, obviously. And now it's stopped raining again. So, just been having a little look at the queue times app, and allegedly Wicker Man's only on a 15 minute queue. Really short queues all around the park today. I think loads of people have been put off by the weather. So we'll go and enjoy Wicker Man on a short queue. And me and Lucy made it all the way to the front row, front row bay in the station of Wicker Man. And then the ride got closed down because somebody had their phone out a couple of trains ahead of us and dropped it on the track so they had to clear the whole station out go sending an engineer around full, full high-vis gear hard hat and everything to go and get his phone off the track so we missed out we have got a, a priority pass to go back on it later so it's not too bad and it's okay because i've been on the pirate ship yeah lucy's been even elliot went on the pirate ship elliot did you enjoy the pirate ship yeah yeah oh shark Oh, careful, there's a shark. Right, I'm going to walk around this big puddle. Elliot's not doing anything of the sort. The wind has picked up quite a bit now. It's a little bit windier than it was this morning. Smiler and Oblivion are closed at the moment, so heading over to Forbidden Valley. Give Nemesis another go, I think. For another pit stop. Cheers to Rich for the beer. Sidra. Sidra. It's not cider. Soida. <laughs> we finished off with a little ride on Jewel at the end. Been a fantastic day with Rich and Lucy and the boys. It's a bit on and off with the weather at all hours today, but to be fair, it's for the most part it's been alright. I think other parts of the country have had it worse off. I think uh, I heard it's been pretty bad in Blackpool today, so it's really unfortunate because Pleasure Beach had late night riding due to be on tonight and they've had to cancel that. But it's been it's been all right here it's but i think the weather forecast put a lot of people off so pleasure the sorry alton towers crowd levels here were, were pretty manageable today we got on loads of rides and then just chilled down for a few hours really but time to get on the road now get back to stevie look after her while she's not feeling so good we'll see you guys in a future video thanks very much for watching make sure you hit that subscribe button to follow our adventures and we will see you guys in the next video thanks for watching